This month's reflection is based on verse 10 of Galatians chapter 5. I have confidence in you, in the Lord, that you will adopt no other view. But the one who is disturbing you will bear the punishment, whoever he is. You may be familiar with the 10th chapter of Luke and the story of Mary and Martha, the two sisters who eagerly welcomed Jesus into their home. Like many of us, Martha busied herself with tasks and preparations, ensuring that the Lord would be served well. Meanwhile, Mary sat with Jesus and listened to Him. He eventually said to Martha, You're worried and distracted by many things, but only one thing is necessary. None of Martha's tasks were inherently bad, and Jesus didn't say it was wrong to do them. He gently pointed out that Martha's chores were distracting her from the best thing, Himself. In the same way, the Lord does not ask us to eliminate earthly tasks from our lives. In fact, many things we do day to day are important and admirable, just like Martha's commitment to hospitality. But those of us who are believers must be able to discern what is good from what is best, and when we've allowed something else to take Jesus' place on the throne. Remember, our relationship with Him is the most valuable thing we have. Think about it. Resetting the priorities of our heart is not a one-time thing. Ask the Holy Spirit what may be distracting you from Jesus. And how do you feel knowing undivided attention honors God?